Hey guys, Amber Roo here. Guess who's back, baby? I'm so sorry I haven't posted anything in a good few months. Um, I wanted to post this video uh, after the LFCC, like a couple of months after, just because I thought, hey, good filler before the MCM Expo in a, about 12 days. But my Mac decided to be a little son of a gun and as soon as I opened iMovie, it was like, nah, I ain't having this. I ain't working for you, son. Get out of here. I was like, oh. <laughs> I didn't have enough RAM left. Uh, I'm not a technological wizard, but apparently, well, I had two gigs on my Mac. So I had to wait until I ordered in some uh, more RAM. So I got eight gigs. Now I can make really lots more videos. Um, as long as I've got enough cool stuff to kind of talk about. So yeah, here's this video. Um, I hope you guys missed me. You probably haven't. You've probably forgotten all about me. But yeah, story of my life. I thought I would talk about my trip to London back in August. So yeah, it was quite a while ago. I went to visit my friend JV in London and we just ran around and did some really cool stuff and bought lots of cool stuff. I know you're all here for the really cute poo. I never knew you could purchase a piece of fecal matter. That looks so cute. I got it from Artbox and here it is. Look at this little fella. Isn't he the cutest piece of poo you've ever seen? I don't want to use him. He's a pencil sharpener so you can kind of sharpen stuff up his butt if a piece of poo had a little bum hole times two. I've still left the barcode on, I've just realised. Look how happy he is for a piece of poo. Hey guys! I got a few other things. This is one of them. It's a little pad which is absolutely adorable and it has happy and happy. Now is the best time because any other time would just be wrong. <laughs> This is one uh, design in there, and this is another design. And it's purple, and it's got a black cat on it, so it is the ultimate little paper pad for anyone. Not just because my favorite color is purple, and my favorite animal is a cat. The next two pieces are the same. Well, slightly bigger, they're notepads again. This is the first one. It's my boy Rula Kuma. Um, it has waho and I'm always feeling relaxed and I believe Rila Kuma is me in cutie bear form and on the back it says be honest with your feelings but I'm really stubborn and I don't want to do that. The next one is lots of cookies and sweet treat packaging with Rila Kuma on it. Still got the price on it <laughs> but yeah Rila Kuma is me Look at this boy. He's just lounging around eating sweet treats and stuff, doing nothing. That's what I do. Just get fat on sweet treats, add hair on my face, and always feeling relaxed because I'm really lazy and I just don't do anything. With Artbox, you get really cute bags and this is what it all came in. I mean, it's a bit scrumpled up now, but look at it. Look at this stuff. You are the rainbow in my life and I love you so much. I love cookies. Oh, uh, it just kind of says that. I thought it said more stuff. So art box is over and done with. And then I didn't realize in Covent Garden there was a Moomin store. I was like, what the hell? Oh, I love Moomins. As well as purple and Rila Kuma and cats and stuff. I love the Moomins. Snufkin is my man. Well, not man, because that would be a bit weird. I'm not one of those fans. Yeah, so I got lots of cute things. I haven't eaten these yet. I know it might be a bit skanky, but it's only been a few months and they're sweets. But I got some lollies. Can't see this one. Wait a minute. There we go. I got a magnet, as nerdy as that sounds. But in the light, you can't really see it now, but in the light it sparkles. It goes all like sheeny shiny, like the water. And I got a really cute teeny tiny card. Look at him. He's being all magical. 
bunch of cool and stuff. So cute. I love cute things. If anybody ever wants to buy me anything, then anything like this is completely fine. Or a kitten. And last but not least, I went to a very cool place with JV, Orbital Comics. I absolutely love that place. I I know someone who works there and I'm jealous because they just get to wander around with the cool stuff like 24 seven or however long they work for during the week. The only thing I bought there was also just like me. Um, it's called Alone Forever, the single collection. It's an autobiography by Liz Prince and it's hilarious if you're single. I don't know, even if you're not single, I wouldn't know, but it's really funny. I've got like a limited, she signed these little cards and things, I didn't realise, but this is really cute. I got 180. Just look at this. It's, uh, it's so funny. <laughs> look how good this is. Definitely recommend purchasing that because it's just, it's top notch. Top class. 10 out of 10. It's brilliant. It's amazing. You should buy it. Buy it today. I'm going to shut up and I'm going to go now so you can watch the small snippets of my day in London. Hopefully you guys can check out the rest of my videos, like, subscribe, share, do whatever you want. Just don't unfollow me. <laughs> no, I don't mind. Do whatever you want. <laughs> and I will hopefully have another video shortly. Yeah, you'll get another MCM video, maybe more. I might split it in between days. See how I feel. I should be cosplaying the Bludgeoning Angel Docker Chan once again, the cutie patootie, and also I should be cosplaying my rogue uh, outfit that I wore to the LFCC just because there's a couple of um, Marvel things going on and I want to get in on the action. So, see you around, guys. Hopefully, see the expo. If you do see me, please say hello because I love everybody and I kind of got a little bit emotional when a couple of people were like oh you're that girl from YouTube I was like I'm a star see you around enjoy